pulse output problem in electromagnetic flow meter findings fault and solution here transistor bc107 found damaged need to replace it by new one so disconnect uh, the motherboard from flow meter assembly So now checking transistor which one used for pulse output. This is NPN transistor so base to emitter and base to collector will show continuity for a good transistor but here uh, this one faulty so checking this by a digital multimeter in diode mode. Here one portion is showing continuity and another is open so need to replace it by new one this transistor used here for pulse output of electromagnetic flow meter so removing the faulty transistor Here using soldering iron and sucker for desoldering. This transistor is damaged. So clear the transistor base emitter collector hole by desoldering sucker. Again we check faulty transistor, here one portion is showing continuity and another is open. Now we testing a new transistor, both portion is showing continuity. So install this transistor into the motherboard. Now this NPN BC107 transistor installing the motherboard to solve pulse output problem in electromagnetic flow meter. This flow meter used in dyeing machine for filling water into the dyeing bath and measuring the continuity uh, quantity of water. All industrial dyeing machine using flow meter. This flow meter is used in dyeing machine fill line for fill counter. So it is drain down and can bc107 transistor now assemble the flow meter
after done the assembling you can set its inflow meter and power up and controlling connection setup then you need you can uh, do the operation into the machine so this flow meter is ready for operation